Where's green lead? Another room that's gonna be hard to traverse in physical form. Howdy. Oh, it's one of these. All right, Jimmy. Let's do our let's do our bouncing puzzle. Let's see. It's a tr it's a try shot, so I assume just lining up three of these specifically somewhere is the right answer to all of it. Is it U three? It might be U three. Don't know if I can get cl in the right position for it though. It's probably these three right here. If I can line all three of them up, it'll probably make it its way around the whole room. Maybe not. Come on. Not exactly, no. I shoot you down. We'll be fine, what can go wrong? Um... Shoot everywhere! It's no big deal, I got this. It, uh... Doesn't exactly work that way. Seems to be a low ricochet room. Let's see, it has to hit the top and the bottom somehow is the crazy part. Oh, there we go. I just kind of shot everywhere. <laughs> Nailed it. I'm not sure if there was a perfect angle for that one, but they seem to make it pretty abusable by just letting you shoot everywhere anyway, so... I don't know. Maybe they should have designed the puzzle differently if they didn't want us to do that, I guess. We have a lot of upgrades now. Prismatic Body Shield, there we go. We now have every skill in the entire game. Let's look into upgrades. Uh, more energy for pre charge times. What's an upgrade I'd like to s I can upgrade my vacuum force. Extreme sucking force. And increase sucking range. Otherwise, what else would I want to go for? Let's go for, yeah, I'll go for sucking force. For now. And range. So our upgrades are at 31 out of 38. There are only seven left and they're all those, uh, more passive upgrades. 21 out of 28 objectives, a lot of rooms explored now. Two energy sacks left. Okay. What's my next goal? Oh yeah, actually going further down on this one will give me things to do. Goodbye, body. I'll never forget you. I'll pr I might forget you. Why explode each mine room? Why must you be full of danger? Let's see. Well, that doesn't seem safe. Was he just shooting in a straight line over and over again? It seems like he was just shooting for the sake of it. Shoot at me! Shoot at me! Yeah, there we go. Earl, we found cryo chambers. The type our data says were used to house humanity's bodies. They're all empty. Abandoned. This is not what we hoped for. Still have hope, everybody. We may find what we're going for one day. Or not, I don't know. We might totally fail to find anything useful. Oh my god, this is a death room. Alright, let's just deal with you guys one at a time, why don't we? There we go. If I can serve my power, we're good. As long as I don't go too fast, we should be safe. Just let that power recharge. And soon all of the hazards will be gone. There we go. Oh, oh, ow, ow. Pain. Gotta make this room child safe for all those levitating head children that can get in this room in the first place. Oh, we got some more. I'm just gonna pump them into something at this point. Melee bonuses, sure. I mean, all the priorities are down, so it really just comes down to like, let's find stuff to use these on. So can I use these, so I can make these into explosives with X? The question is whether or not that is enough to blow up the that that uh 
the weird... I don't know, the pixel... Uh, pixel, what am I saying? The weirdly uh, cracky looking room. So I would like to think that maybe that's... Maybe you get through those rooms by exploding them like that. Uh, it's pretty universal language in video games to use cracks to indicate that a room can be exploded like that, so maybe that'll be true. We need a blue to continue. I know what to- I got just the thing. Oh crap. I made a terrible mistake. Oh. Well. Good thing there's a blue up here, haha! -ha. I'll save you! Got him. All set. No! Don't do that. Do none of those things. There's more purple around here. I think I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna avoid purple related things for as long as possible in an attempt to fully explore everything that was given to us by getting access to blue. And then I'll look into what purple takes me to. Cause I, I imagine I'll, I'll probably find my first purple before we finish exploring all the blue. But we gotta prioritize these things. Because at some point the game's probably just gonna end. So I'd like to leave that spot for last. Hello? More cryo rooms? Yep, everything's just empty. Empty and sad. I could be doing something important instead. Nah, this is your life now. Forever. Enjoy! There's no escape from the endless drudgery that is your existence. Forever. Ah, 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 ah! Leave me alone. Ah, crap, I should have stayed on that thing. No, get on the other side, there we go. Bit of a wasted effort at that point. So there's my left, click my left stick for invincibility mode. Oh, an enemy's using it. I'm not sure what to do about that. We got a, we got a healing restoration location. Our goal is to go up. Yeah, what do I do when an enemy turns invincible? Seems awfully problematic for me. Although he's not really chasing me. I guess it doesn't matter. Oop, hello. Don't leave things behind! It'd be cool if I could get every single upgrade in the game. Well, I don't- I'm not really looking for it. I'm not really looking to grind for it, though, if I don't quite make it on, on my own. Oh, hey. Not escaping me. I see you hiding up here. One more. That's another health. Three to go on that. Ah! The Taurus are taking heavy casualties. I have reports of a new, deadly type of shepherd we've never seen before. Does it have to be a green laser for this one? Hey, Mappy. Nice to see you. I should probably grab you now in case I accidentally kill you. <laughs> Give me your map. Aha! Tiny room down here. Just as I suspected. Um... Looks like this is gonna loop around to a previous blue spot that I never fully explored before, I think. But, uh, if I shoot everything around, we'll at least get rid of the laser. Which may or may not actually have a reason for me to, to even bother, but... Oops! Do we have a split shot on this thing? Do they even light up when I shoot them? They do. It doesn't get much better. Probably overcomplicating a little bit with that one. This is a weird sight. I could be doing something important instead. I wonder if I'm supposed to shoot from up there instead of down here. It's conceivable. Oh. But without the door open, we're screwed. So... Let's try bouncing for the door. At least. That'll work. Nope. There we go. Nope, it's not... I messed this one up somehow. 
Don't mess up for me. Uh, this'll work. The explosion caught me off guard. I thought I actually exploded and died for a second there. Hi there. We have an elevator. With a lack of robots for me to use. I can't dock onto those weird mines, can I? Hello. Don't mind me. I wish I could. I wish I could control those. Gonna have to bring you all the way up for this little, this one body. That's probably close enough. Just try not to blow it up. But I think I need to have a, a, the robot body be above the laser to take it out. Granted, I don't know if I even have a reason to take out the, the laser at this point. Because I've already been on both sides of it. Oh. Interesting, I can set you up to shoot in, in, uh, indefinitely. That seems awfully useful, actually. Huh. This seems awfully abusable. Now I just need to hit three of them with this guy. There we go. Huh. Didn't really think about that at first, but having a... Having a second character be used as a... An auto turret actually takes care of the whole problem. There seems to be something under here. Oops, destroyed everything. Hey there. This one's helmet thrust. They really think of everywhere, everything. They put something in absolutely every little nook and cranny. Got to figure out how to blow up that one wall, though. I do think it's going to be the that bomb ability I have. Is there anything left over? That bottom corner there. And that. Otherwise, we need. Oh, there's a, that bottom right there needs. Yeah, everything. Everything in the bottom of that chamber needs blue. Okay. Well, that's disappointing. Bottom corner room down here discovered. It's it's a blue room. There's a blue man in it. Hey, Mappy. Oh, teleported on accident instead of instead of uh, downloading map data. There we go. Nothing new this time. All right. I figure I'll just try periodically in case there's a secret hiding on any of them. So everything up here looks completed, so it's just some lower details. Now we're coming back to the bottom of the map. Making my way downtown. Oh god, lasers, why? So much laser. Danger, danger, danger. Oop. There we go. Missed my decapitation spot for a second there. Let's go over here. Hey. Another one of these. They're just everywhere. What's your deal? Can I pull up these bodies at all? No? What could these be used for? And take off your head, sir. I need it. Don't mind me. Ah! Why does it gotta close immediately? Okay, fine. Um... You just keep shooting. Oh, don't get blown up. Okay, get blown up. There we go. Does this do what I want? Do I have to drop it? It's gonna blow up. That didn't really seem to do the job either. What's with these cracked walls? Maybe I'll get my first purple robot, and we'll find out that the purple robot has, like, super destructive capabilities. Oh, goodness. What is going on in this room? Who would design a room to do what's going on right in front of me right now? Seems like an all-around chaotic and insane concept. Now, honestly, the easiest way to take care of them is just doing that real quick. What's down here? Mappy! Garbled sounds. No regrets. You oh, there we go. That's a whole lot more room. Yeah, I think that if I go in, the, in this under area on my left, we're gonna find our way to a purple. And that'll probably be how I figure out how to get past the, some of those exploding walls. Really oh, we have to be blue. Are there any bodies in here? Or are they all destroyed? There's one. I, I got rid of my chance of being able to get through here semi easily. 
I mean, it's all easy, but I mean, like, by destroying all... Oh, that was a laser. Yeah, by destroying all the enemies, I had no way through anymore. We essentially have to start the room over already. Oh, you're destroyed. Might as well just claim you now. Thank you. Let's try to be a little less dead by lasers when I go down this time. Got it. We're clear. Stop, Mappy. What is this nightmare monster? See you later. <laughs> it's gonna wander on past you, apparently. No biggie. Hit. Ooh, force fields. All around. Okay. Danger. No so now the mines are blue instead of green. So even mi they give They give mines different level of security clearance? That's a lot of precaution for a temporary creature. If I can't hurt that thing, I'm just gonna move past it. Gotcha. Can I walk on this thing? Yeah, I can. At least there's that. That's a lot of... Wow. This whole room is filled with danger. Uh, okay. I could use a new body. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. There are dangers abound. I'm through. Huh. Any checkpoints around? So those those are the purples. They're probably tougher. Wait, where am I right now? Wait, oh, my body's gone. I had a moment of panic where I'm like, I can't find my character, where's my body? I must have lost the body. Let's try to nab these guys real quick if I can. They don't cooperate. They're not cooperative. They're hopefully a little tanky though. To help with the situation. Oh, danger! Nope. Uh, even even the purples don't seem they don't even the purples don't seem especially durable. It's just an arbitrary color change, probably. A scatter shot would be really useful for a room like this if I want to be able to hit everything at once. There's so many mines. Is this is this necessary? Like, I gotta. I gotta say, at some point, some parts of this... Entire parts of this game kind of got less fun to play. Oh no, the laser took out the bodies. That guy just that split shot. This whole game kind of got less fun to play when a lot of these rooms just turned into giant clustered messes of danger. Where just everything's just getting shot at once and there's a billion shots on the screen. Ah, oh, crap. I missed the head. Like, like these mines in particular kind of made me want to play chunks of this game less. <laughs> oh. I'm also a little tired of how the rooms constantly won't open unless they get hit by certain lasers. I feel like key cards kind of feel like they should be a permanent change to an extent. It's kind of frustrating when you, uh... When I've already cleared the whole area, but now I find myself stuck on a green body, so I'm like, oh, I can't open any doors now because I have a green body, so I'm not cool enough. God damn it, I just got a body. I'm try I'm just trying to get the green guy, but I need to get through the doors. Everything's danger. No, don't destroy the body, I just got it. No, you Ah Ah, uh, I'm just trying to get the green body. Because the green body has a split shot, so I want the split shot to take out this crazy-ass room. Maybe if I just get the mines to get set off in the right moment, they'll explode. Maybe the mine enemies will- ah. I'm just- this is- This is just overwhelming and frustrating right now, because I'm just blowing up every two seconds, it seems. Here, mines, mines, come over here. Can you just, like, blow up and- no, shoot everywhere. No, don't- don't exp yeah, do that, do that, but over here. Stop, ex stop exploding. I don't think I... I can't control them, can I? Damn it. Shoot me. Shoot everywhere. It ha does it happen yet? What? What's knocking me out of the room? I'm not even noticing when, when I leave the room. I'm just suddenly out of the room. 
No, we still haven't succeeded yet. Alright, I'll try to grab... No, they're gonna blow me up with lasers. Ah, oh, crap. What the fuck? I just... Uh, I'm just trying to... I just want to go underground, and to go underground, I need to blow up the pads, but blow up the pads, I need a multi-shot of some kind, and I can't control the mines, because they go off whenever they want to, and they explode when I go near them, so I can't tell them to, to shoot everywhere, which is what I want them to do. So I'm trying to get the green guy, but the green guy gets shown, gets blown up when I try to cross the room, and I can't get it fucking... I, just, I don't... I don't know if I care anymore, man. <laughs> I don't, there's a certain level of frustration where it just stops being fun. <laughs> Because this game isn't... I don't know. It hasn't really been a skill-based game for the most part. It's mostly just been wander around and do stuff game. But now I'm constantly being overwhelmed by just lasers in every direction simultaneously and giant clusters of nightmarish mayhem. And I don't know if I want to deal with that anymore. It's just... Like when I'm in that room with the mines, sometimes the room is just covered in like 50 random lasers going in different directions and bouncing off walls. Like... What a... I don't... I don't want to deal with that. I don't really want to. Here we go. I might just move on and ignore that particular thing just to save my sanity. Because Jesus... What do you want from me at some point, game? Oh. My bad. Did not press the joystick in time. My mistake. Did it, is it already purchased or not? Oh, it is. Alright. Now I've got it this time. That was my bad. Alright. Whole room's purple. Hello. I would like your head now. Oops. It feels like a missed opportunity that uh, the bodies aren't boss fights or something. I kind of feel like I would have preferred that. Constantly swapping bodies to get the right body for the security clearance is kind of a bummer when you've already had that clearance before. Like, once, you, once I've had blue... Finding myself momentarily on a green body and unable to go through doors is kind of frustrating, for example. And so, like, now that I've got a purple one, any time that I find myself on, a, on something other than purple, I'm going to be annoyed that I can't go through the doors. kind of feels like there should have just been a boss fight for each color or something. Like, that would have been more satisfying. And also, as a result, if we did that, it might have been... It might have felt more meaningful when I got a new color. Because, uh, right now, when I get a new color, it's like, oh, there's purples here. I took it over. Cool, I'm purple now. Like, it's... There's no there's no real, like, victory moment. Like, oh, wow, what an amazing accomplishment to have in the middle of this game. I finally got the purple. You don't, you don't earn it via, like, a boss fight or anything, so it's just like, oh, I guess I... I guess I have the most powerful security clearance of the entire game. I did, it just... It just anticlimactically happens. Because, like, after this crazy mess of a room, you go into this little side chamber, and you just hop on a purple body. It's like, oh, I guess I have this now. Okay. The cryo storage facility is a highly secure area. Can I upgrade the heal rate? Did I ever do that? Where's the auto heal? Is it you? Where's the heal? Oh, it's, pro it's probably way up here, huh? Body armor. Or are, are you the heal? You're the body regen, so I need two points for that. I should have bought that sooner. We're, we're almost there, I just need a little bit more blue, but... I don't know if the game's gonna end in this next room or what. Oh, I've been here before, never mind. Where am I trying to go next? Oh, I'm off by one floor, that's the mistake. Getting mounted! Alright, we need to go upstairs by one floor and then continue. But yeah, these rooms are just... a mess! Oh no, I missed the ele- oh no... <laughs> I missed the elevator. Oh, you're purple. This room just magically became occupied by a purple all of a sudden. What if I charge shot? That's not the secret either. Huh. Thought I might figure it out. What about the X crossed with bumper? Nope. I thought the explosive takeoff would be the secret, maybe. Alright. Well, the good news is purple's apparently everywhere now. The bad news is, uh, every room now is just a cluster nightmare of explosions. Yeah, I, I just need to use the invincibility, don't I? I don't have a body. <laughs> oh, you're purple. Go for the head. 
There we go. Oh, right, I forgot about that ability. I actually, I genuinely forgot that ability existed from earlier. My bad. Onwards, purple. We've made it. A new room. Uh-oh. Are you going to be invincible too? You got a cutscene this time? I've already met that guy before. Was that supposed to be the introduction of that enemy type? How do I hurt you then? With a charge shot? Do I want him to suicide? What's going on here? What are you trying to shoot at? He's just kind of shooting wherever he feels like. Do those chandeliers do anything? Nope. Oh, crap. Crap. Do I just shoot you a lot? Is that all, is that all this really comes down to? Oh, wow. I do just shoot you a lot. There goes his shield. Just like that. Ah, crap. That's bad. Where am I? There I am. Ram. Oh, I'm gonna die soon. Careful. Yeah, you just... You really do just beat... You just beat on them for a while until they fall apart. <laughs> Here, I thought the shield meant they were invincible. Because, like, when I have a shield, I just go forever and I'm invincible and then it wears off eventually. So I thought that maybe I was supposed to make them shoot themselves, maybe, to extinguish their shield. But you just shoot them, and there's no puzzle there. I totally, I totally thought it was a puzzle. Whoops. I could be doing something important instead. Um. Hello. Oh, very large pyramid room. Oh yeah, we're in the opposite triangle room. Uh, lift seems broken, so I think I just have to go on my own. Boom. Oh my goodness, so many lasers on screen. So much laser. Okay, we'll be fine. Everything's fine. Yeah, you really do just hit them and the shield comes off. Huh. I totally took that to be an invincibility state. I thought the whole point was to try to find an alternate way to deal with them. Not that they would just stay awake. So that one laser guy that was giving me trouble earlier down here, I probably could have defeated. I thought... So since he was covered in the same prismatic force field thing, that was on the floor and used for all the force fields you have to disable by taking out the bounce pads. I thought, not bounce pads, the reflector pads, the laser pads, whatever you want to call them, the ones where I bounce, where I shoot all the pads in the room. Uh, when something's protected by the prismatic force field, I shoot all those pads and the force field goes away. So based on that, I thought that that's what I had to do when an enemy was covered in it too, is, is I need to take out the, the room's puzzle in order to proceed. But it seems to be wrong. So I need a purple to continue in that direction. What's up here? Gimme, gimme. Oh, 12 out of 15 thrust. That's catching up. For a while it was the primary thing I was always upgrading, but it fell behind over the course of Luna Base. One more cryo storage checkout. Could this be the last one? The map looks pretty filled in. This might be the last one. Face to face. 
I'm on my way to get you. Meet me at the landing pad. Shepard Auxiliary Unit 3 Alpha 47, deploy immediately. The aberration is to be neutralized. In addition, the unauthorized citizen social group known as the Daughters of Lucia 13. I could be doing something important instead. So, here's the big nasty room that revealed me to be a clone. So that's sad. But, uh, we're still alive. It just means we don't, I don't really have a body to reattach to. It looks pretty dead. And all the other ones have been empty, which bodes pretty poorly for everyone else. We're detecting increased shepherd activity. We're withdrawing before we take any more casualties. It's clear now that there are no bodies here. Is the dealer wrong? Or is this a setup? Really could be either. This could have all been a trap. Or maybe the bodies were here, but they're just long gone. 